Hi everybody. Hope you guys are having a great day. Today is Friday, July 22nd. I haven't been on here for a while because I haven't really been feeling well, but I'm doing a lot better now. So hope everybody had a really good weekend, a good week, and start your weekend off good by just enjoying life, the outdoors. It's going to be a hot one here in Ohio, but wherever you live, just enjoy your day. Oh, I wanted to talk to you guys about uh, house plants. I love house plants, but as you if as you can see, I have one here. That's a photodendron, and I have one here, and that's a poto plant. I'm also going to be put, adding another one in my bedroom space as soon as I put together a nightstand. So that's what I came to you guys today to show you. I got some wood from a little area around the corner. It's a business, like a small business, like electrical shop or something but sometimes they have like pallets and stuff laying around and I spoke to the guy before and he told me I could come and get some pieces of wood or you know if I wanted to get some pallets because later on in the future I do want to build me I know this is going to sound a little crazy to some people but I would love to have a tiny home or a pallet you could make you a pallet home uh, and it doesn't really take it doesn't take that long. I think if I was to get started on it, just say if I wanted to do it like in August, it probably could be done by the end of September if I did it, you know, if I had a couple people to help me. But yeah, that'll be in a different vlog. But today, I just wanted to talk about, like I said, these plants I have here. And I have a couple of downstairs in my, uh, no, I have one in my front room, one in another bedroom. There's another one in another bath bedroom. I also have one in the kitchen, one in the bathroom. And the one I will be putting in my bedroom with these two. And it'd probably be a, the same one, either a, a poto or a, a photodendron. And also, you guys, I was telling you about the wood. Now, I found, I got this wood, as you can see here. I hope you guys can see it. I have like, let me show you. I have these five these five pieces here and I have these two blocks now these were already put together so I would when I seen that when I actually seen the two that was put together that's what made me want to um, pick it up because I seen that I can already have a base made so now all I have to do is just add to it so yeah I have this one here, these four, and what I'm going to do, my plan is to, let me show you guys. My plan is to put these two together. You guys tell me what you think, because what I'm going to do is, once I put this together, I'm debating it if I wanted to paint it like a whitewash or something like that. So I'm really um, not sure yet. Because everything in my home is white. And I just think this would be so nice if I add some white paint to it. So yes, I am going to be putting these two together. Which I will be having like, you know, this area here. I, go, I will have this area to put like, um, you know, a book or a plant or something like that. And then these three, I was going to put... Well, maybe I have to put this together a little closer. I just want to show you guys what it's going to look like when I get done. And what you can do with just finding, just finding some pieces of wood. You can make yourself some um, decor, homemade decor of your own. So yes, this is what it's going to, this is what I'm going to do to it. That might fall off, but yeah. So you guys can see, let me turn it around. So this is what this is what it will look like when I get done with it. Basically, it's just a, the top part will be, you know, the base. No, that this would be the top. This would be the top part. The bottom will be the base, and I will be able to put a lamp up here. This lamp, this lamp here, is what I want to put up there. And then I'm just going to be adding, you know, 
was going over it maybe maybe two two or three times or maybe just two times just to give it that antique white look so I'm not really sure because I've never done nothing like this before but I have painted other furniture and it turned out great actually this dresser here just paint it one or two times just so it can you know it can it can go through the wood and then I'll brush it down that way it'll give it like that white antique look and I think it would go better with my hair. So you guys tell me what you think in the comments and I'll show you the finished product anyway in my next vlog. Hope you guys have a lovely weekend. Enjoy your day. Spend your time wisely. Spend it with your family, your kids, your loved ones, older people, whatever you have to do just enjoy life. Hi guys, it's me again. I'm so sorry about the last video. I think I made a mistake and made a mistake and put my finger over my microphone. I'm not for sure, but I was telling you guys just to have a lovely weekend. Enjoy yourselves and live your live up to your greatest potential every day and simply, you know, just enjoy your family, enjoy the simple things in life. But I was going to show you guys cuz I'm actually finished priming my piece of my wood pieces that I found. And here is the final result. It is like, like I said, you guys, like a whitewash. I think you guys can see that. I didn't do anything to underneath it, but I just painted around the outskirts of it. So let me should turn it around so you guys can see how it turned out. Yeah, so I like it. And this is going to be my nightstand. So I'm going to be putting that right here on the side of my bed it's still a little damp but I'm going to still I think I might cover it again with a little bit more but yes you guys that's that's what I got the wood for was to do that and also the plant here this is the plant that was in my basement and this is a mother's tongue it's really a sans severia plant sans severia and it's very pretty and it's really a good air purifier so what I did was I took a piece of this and as I told you guys I was going to make me another plant to put on my nightstand so I put that piece inside this flower pot and I think that looks really really good so yes I'm going to be setting that on this side of my nightstand and I'm going to be placing my lamp that I got from a thrift store long time ago for like I think it was like ten dollars but it's very pretty it still had the tag attached which is right here if you guys can see it yeah so that's that and also I'm going to be adding just a little magazine and also my Bible and if near future I'm going to be placing that there and then for the final touches 
I'm going to be adding this rock here. This rock means a lot to me. It's very sentimental. My mom went to Arizona a couple of years ago to visit some friends and her partner's uh, son. So yeah, she bought me back a, a rock from Arizona. So yeah, you guys, I will be putting that on my nightstand. So yes, look at it, you guys. How do you think that looks? How did it turn out? So yes, girl, something, something really I found, put together, just added some things to it, and this is how it turns out. So yeah, you guys, tell me what you think. I'm going to also be finding me something to put my bed on because I'm actually selling my bed frame because I don't need it anymore. I'm going to either make me a platform bed probably out of the same thing I did here. And um, yeah. So yeah, you guys, tell me what you think. I really like this. And I still have room to like put, you know, a cup of water here. Or anything you know so yeah I have plenty of space on it I'll show you the top of it again that's the three pieces of wood at the top and the two pieces here at the very bottom that was my this was these were the side pieces that were already put together and these these two were my, for my base and this these three was for the top so yes that's my final look of what I wanted to accomplish for my project and yes, you guys, I really, really love this. I think it looks really good in my bedroom. And it goes well with everything. I didn't make it too high. It's actually like the size of my bed, you know, up here. So when I'm laying down in the bed, I can get to everything. I have room to put my cell phone and other little items. Like I said, I have some more books I will be adding here. But yes, you guys, tell me in the comments, what do you think? And I'll show you some more things. I really love home decor and DIYs. I don't like spending a lot of money. I'm very frugal with my money. I'm not a real cheap person, but if I can make something, I'd rather make it than buy it. And I think a lot of you guys need to, you know, jump on board and do some of those things too in your near future or later on in life. But you only live once and it's good to, you know, do things different and try to enjoy something, make something and see, you know, how it turns out. And you might be pleased like I am. So yes, you guys, Subscribe to my channel if you like my videos, and I'll see you next time. Remember, live a simple life. Bye-bye.